What's up guys, I'm James, welcome to Boot Wizard Boot Reviews. If you've followed the channel for a while, you'll have seen me do boot battles, boot reviews, you'll have seen me break down boots in just 60 seconds. Well today we're going to take all of that, we're going to mash it together, and not only am I going to break down and review a boot and convince you that it's better than another boot in just 60 seconds, I'm going to do it against one of the rising stars of YouTube football. YouTube football boots will never be the same again once this girl catches fire. Today I am doing this video with the one, the only, the fastest reviewer in the West. It is Soccer Knocker. What's up guys, it's Sakunaka here back with another video and today I'm so excited to do a collaboration with Boot Wizard. As he said, we're going to be convincing you in just 60 seconds so you know I have no problem with that. So make sure you guys go like the video if you enjoyed and subscribe to both of our channels. Let's get into the video. So what we're going to do today is I am going to represent the Adidas Predator 20.1 Low and Sokka is going to represent the Adidas Predator 20 Plus. I get 60 seconds to convince you why this is better, she gets 60 seconds to convince you why that is better and at the end you decide who the victor is. So without any further ado, let's put 60 seconds on the clock and without any preparation or prior planning, let's try and convince you that the 20.1 low is better than the 20 plus. 3, 2, 1, go! Well, the first and most obvious thing is that the 20.1 low just looks better. High cut predators that come up to like your mid calf who wants that? Completely ridiculous. And speaking of things that are completely ridiculous, the 20 plus, the demon skin, it pokes out at just such a ridiculous angle. The grip that you get off it is stupid. You can't control a ball properly. With this, it's much more refined. It gives you a much better touch on the ball and it's certainly not gonna wear down as quickly. So this even wins points for durability, which means it's gonna last longer, which means it's better value for money. And not only is it better value for money there, it's better value for money because it's cheaper. This costs 220 euros, the 20 plus is nearly 300 euros. This also has exactly the same tooling, so why pay the extra? It has the same lineup, why pay the extra? This also gives you laces, so you get more, that gives you better lockdown, better responsiveness in your boot. So instead of your foot moving around and you having to struggle and get that shoehorn in there, this, this is the way to go. I have to say that was a pretty good attempt, but my boots are going to eat yours for lunch. Countdown starting in two, one, let's go. Starting off with how they look, they just look so much better. I mean, they're so intimidating. You feel so confident on the pitch. And let me tell you, your competitors do not want to see these on the other side of the half. Now, going to who players wear these, I mean, biggest players in the world, Pogba, Deli Alley, and that's all I know of right now, who wear these boots. So these definitely have no cap. I mean, just look at them. If you told someone this day and age, 20.1 low versus 20 plus, they'd obviously pick these. I mean, they're the biggest hype right now in football, but now getting on to why they're better. I mean, you do pay more, I guess, for less. No, that is not right. I mean, yes, you get no laces, but you get a prime knit kind of upper right here. That is so much nicer, super soft, super plush, and just not as like stiff as the 20.1 low would be. And look at that, look at that flex. You get the wearable metallic outsole, super nice, super amazing. No one's missing you on the pitch with these. The high, high cut actually feels amazing. I've had no lockdown problems with these, and I mean, I've hit the ball super hard. These are just absolutely amazing boots, and it's a no-brainer. Okay, time's up, vote now. So if you now want to click up in the top corner of the screen here, I think, you will be able to vote. You either vote for Boot Wizard or you vote for Soccer Knocker. But that's all from me here in Denmark today. That's it from Boot Wizard. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. If you enjoyed, subscribe to both of our channels down below. Support the video with a like if you guys want to see more from this series. And go turn on the post notifications for both our channels so you don't miss another one of our boot videos. Thanks for watching. Soccer Knocker out! I hope you enjoyed the video and we'll see you soon.